friends. I hope you're having an inspiring day. We are doing a couch review today because we got a new couch about two months ago and we got it from Cozy, which was a brand new brand to us. We had heard lots about it, but hadn't actually purchased one of their couches before. We wanted to get a new couch to kind of brighten up the space. Our old couch was a darker leather style couch. We had had it for like five years and Simba had scratched pretty much all of it up. Um, we really liked that couch, but we did want to try something a little bit lighter, a little brighter and kind of something that would fit our aesthetic a little bit more. So they gifted us this couch, but uh, I wanted to do a really honest review on our experience with it from start to finish as a regular consumer. In terms of why Cozy, so one, obviously, as we mentioned, they have a white couch, which is what we wanted. Dave actually- like cream. Yeah, it's cream. Dave fought me on this. He was not a fan of the white couch idea. Such a bad idea always for <laughs> furniture. Always a bad idea. <laughs> don't listen to me. Don't listen to me ever. So well, that's fine. More on this later, but uh, so that was one. They had this white, really nice fabric that I like this sort of creamy fabric that I felt really worked well with the home. Secondly, they had modular pieces, which was really interesting because we have a, a century old Toronto home. The space here is kind of odd. Uh, we needed a very specific size shape and a lot of couches that kind of come all in one and aren't modular are a little bit harder to kind of fit into your space rather this couch kind of fit into our space rather our space having to fit it so that was the second thing third thing was price so originally we were thinking about buying this couch before they even gifted it to us and the price point on this was really affordable uh, it depends on how many pieces you get and what kind of configuration uh, but this couch was like under three grand, which for a couch I feel like is a really, really affordable price point. And the last thing was how many great reviews it had with regards to shipping and assembly. I feel like, especially if you know, you're doing it yourself, having something that's really easy to kind of put together is super helpful. In terms of the buying process experience that we've had, it's pretty simple. You kind of go online, you choose the configuration for your space, obviously it has all the dimensions and everything, and you kind of purchase each item. Separately. Yeah, well you get a package if there is one, but you can always add more pieces. So like we added an ottoman uh, that wasn't originally, like it's not attached to the couch, things like that if we wanted to, like let's say our space was different and we wanted to make it longer later on, we could definitely do that as well. But I found the buying process to be really simple, all online, super seamless, uh, and it got delivered straight to our door in boxes that were very manageable. Actually, yeah, they actually had these like handles. They're manageable. These yeah, these plastic handles on the side. There's, so you weren't like fumbling around. Um, we had the two of us, but we could have. I think I could probably have handled it by myself. <laughs> Dave doesn't believe that I am. No faith. I have no any capability whatsoever. <laughs> but regardless, we actually were away when it got delivered. And it actually sat in our mudroom in these modular boxes. And because we were away and because of, I guess, their shipping and delivery fulfillment system, it was actually able to sit in our mudroom. And we didn't actually have to be here to accept it. Um, our mudroom was secure. So we're lucky to have a mudroom. Yeah, we're lucky to have a mudroom. But all that to say that, you know, what I hate is like having deliveries and needing to be home for like a six hour window. That is the bane of my existence. And then they come for like 15 minutes. Anyways, we didn't have to experience that uh, with this particular couch. But I'm going to rewind it because it's been two months now yes. with the couch. I'm going to rewind it to when I had blonde hair and when we set up the couch to show you guys kind of how the setup process was. So each piece actually arrived in their individual boxes, which I love. A lot more easy to transport. They actually left everything in our mudroom super easy delivery was hassle free there is our old couch goodbye sayonara old couch and the new couch we we're just about to unbox here i also love this how cute is this i am a seat open the arms first makes it a lot more user friendly than getting a bunch of pieces where you don't know where to even start so this is the color we got it is ivory the canvas feels really, really good so far. I'm a little worried about the white because of that guy, 
but we're gonna try to scotch guard it they also i believe have replacement covers if you need them so that's also a really good point but so far super happy about the seams and the quality we're gonna start putting it together but it seems pretty straightforward So when you are on the website, you can actually customize how many pieces you want, how many ends, how many centers, how many center seats, how long it needs to be. And I feel like that's so awesome because each of them are separate pieces. Let's say your space changes in the future and you need something smaller or bigger. You can always add one of these center pieces or remove one and they all still connect. So it's super customizable, which I love. I really like that they've got these wooden cork stoppers at the bottom of your legs. Wow. Wow. <laughs> you have dumb and dumb over here. So each of the cushions actually have a zipper like this that you can unzip and then I would assume change the cover if you need to or wash them or whatever. You always want to have removable cushions in my opinion. <sighs> Pretty good. So overall in out of 10, how would you rate like the efficacy, easiness of the setup? It's like an eight. Very easy. Very easy. Anybody can set it. Oh, even even thinking, you can set it up. I was thinking like one being. I was like eight. That seems really hard. No. You know, what is one being the, the lowest? We have different rating systems. Yeah. I would say, I would agree. I think it's like an eight or a nine. Um, obviously, like a couch is still large pieces. So. Like, they just clip together. Yeah, they just clip together. But it wasn't like, it's not like a pop-up or something like that. I don't even know if there's a pop-up couch. It's a couch. <laughs> it's, a, it's a couch. In terms of comparison to other couches, I would say definitely the easiest couch we've ever put together. I loved that sort of lock system because I feel like you can really change your sofa quite often if you wanted to. But it still feels really, really secure. So, it has been two months. And our review on the couch is that we still really like it. Uh, I love, love the color. Every time I walk downstairs and I see this couch in this space, it just makes me smile. It's my favorite space in the whole house. Just because it is so nice and bright, we were able, it kind of feels like linen-y in texture. Um, I did end up scotch guarding it. Um, not that it's really come in handy scotch guarding it because no, we haven't really spilled anything like wine or things like that. I did test it though to see if the Scotch Guard worked. It did work to kind of make it water repellent. Um, but in terms of it being white, we have Simba and there's well, just- Tell us more. There's just nothing that's going to stop it from getting dirty, I've realized. Like I thought I would, it's really not that noticeable unless you're like actually looking at the couch, but like his footprints are here. I can see that. I feel like it's still gonna be like pretty easy to get out. I haven't got around to washing it out, but that is just, that's just the reality of having a white couch. So white couches, definitely something to think about whether or not you really want it for your home. Uh, in terms of the comfort, when we first got it, it was a little bit stiff. It took some time to break in. Yeah, it took some time to kind of like get to be plushy, a I little bit wider. Butt. I had to work my butt groove. <laughs> Dave had to work his butt groove into the couch, but now it's super comfortable, but it does take some time. So if you're thinking about um, like a comfort level, it's definitely super comfortable, but to get it to be like super plush, uh, you have to wear it in just kind of like anything in life. In terms of the structure of the couch, uh, it has held up, it's only been two months, but um, yeah, no complaints, feels really sturdy, doesn't really like move around. Uh, we really like the fact that the ottoman, you can kind of move around to wherever you want versus the sectional that we had before that was all, like a laid out sectional where you couldn't really move it around. Having that option was is really, really nice. It has pilled a little bit on the fabric, uh, not that you can't, like fix it with a, like a depiller or a razor. That's a little hack for you. Um, but it's just something different because we haven't really had a, a fabric couch before. 
we've only ever had leather couches so that was just a few different things to keep in mind like fabric couches in general do pill you need to like depill them uh, but for the price point I feel like this couch is such a great option I think if you are in somewhere like a condo or a starter home and then you need to move and then you move into a larger home where you want like a sectional you want a larger a wider couch this is such a great option because you can add those pieces on Later. afterwards yeah I think that's like the key winner of this couch it's something that kind of grows with you and grows with your space obviously if you choose the color white there are more don't have dogs <laughs> don't have dogs or just like don't or have people yeah or like make sure that people if they're coming in like blue jeans they're not like fresh blue jeans we haven't had that but I've been pretty a pretty big stickler about people who wear denim I always ask them like is that fresh denim before they sit on the on a white couch but that's just the reality of having a couch um, that's a light color you can also get it in other colors I will say so those are definitely gonna have different a completely different your mileage feel. may vary yeah your mileage on the couch may vary depending on the color choices that you make but I just love the look of a white couch like I don't know if you have a white couch out there and you were able to find a way to kind of keep it sparkly white cream whatever don't have a dog um with a dog please <laughs> please give me your tips I'm asking for them don't begging stop. begging for them yeah. Overall, I would say that this is definitely a great affordable option. There's not a ton on the market um, that are kind of that like sub three, sub four thousand dollar price point. This is definitely it. Can still grow with you. Has a lot of really great colors. Is an aesthetic and and silhouette that I think works really well for a lot of different spaces and a lot of different uh, styles of home decor. So, if you are interested in a couch, I definitely look into Cozy. Again, this is our completely honest review. Um, other than like a little bit of pilling, obviously like it being dirty from being like just white, the nature of being white. Uh, the setup was really easy, buying process really easy, delivery really easy. Definitely would recommend a cozy as a couch, as affordable couch option in general. But well, we hope you guys like this. I really like having a nice bright white couch. This is such a look at the look at the background. It's so cute. Happy for you. People who vote for white couches, please, in the comments below. But with that, we hope you have an inspiring rest of your day. Remember that kindness doesn't cost a thing, and we'll talk to you next time. Bye!